Hey, this is Joseph Bronson coming at you from the mountains of Oregon, the Misty Mountains. It's raining out here today, and I wanted to talk to you about your workouts. You know, we live in an incredibly unhealthy society, and you all know that. A lot of people are overweight, and you know where I live, up in the mountains of Oregon? Well, and you know the town near here where I teach, where I run my school, uh, just all of the Northwest. A lot of people don't get outside because of the rain. God, I love getting out in the rain. You want to get out and you want to experience Mother Nature. It is so good for your mind, it's so good for your soul, it's so good for your body. Now, outside, Sue and I are outside all the time, and today I'm up here, I'm thinking, what am I going to do for my training? What am I going to talk about with my training today? And I want to show you some environmental training, and I want you to work on trying to adapt different things to your environment. So what I've got right here is I've got a tree that's been cut down by the logging company up here, and it's a down tree, it's a little bit of an angle, and it's pretty narrow on top, and I'm gonna give it a shot at getting a horse dance up there. So, here we go. Whoa, it is whew, pretty narrow up here. All right, man, I gotta work on, whoa, go work on my balance, work on my, oh no. All right, this is some great balance training. If you haven't played on something in a while, remember when you're a kid and you walk down the railroad tracks, which I don't recommend doing, by the way, that is illegal. Did it when I was a kid, I know most of you did. But you know that balance we had? Oh, working on that? This is great. And how many of us work on balance on a regular basis? Balance is so important for us. Body, mind, and soul. Work on your balance. So, here I am, working on my physical balance. Working on my nature balance. Meaning, I'm out in nature and I'm balancing. Whoa! All right. Nice, low stance, yeah. Center, breathe. Ah. All right, now it may not be exactly right here on this tree, but remember, when you're doing your straight horse stance, get your feet parallel and try to get your legs parallel to the ground. All right, that logs a little bit of slope, so I may be a little bit off here. There's very, very, whoa, narrow space, really making my muscles work. Oh, I have to work every direction. Upper body's working to keep me here. Holy smokes, my toes aren't touching, my heels aren't touching, I'm right in the middle of my feet. This is tough. Oh, yeah. Oh, great training. All right, I come up here and see if I can't balance, whoa, and get a kick out of this. A kick on this, this is crazy. All right, let's try a slow front kick here. All right, I'm gonna balance on my left foot. Oh my goodness, this is like I'm on a tightrope here. The top of this log is very, very narrow, and I don't even have the sides of my feet touching. It's just right down the center of my foot. And I'm gonna kick out here. Oh yeah, work those quads, work that balance, wow. Yes, nice. Awesome, Whoa. All right, if you're doing a training out in the environment, make sure you watch out for various things around you that can get you hurt. I've got a lot of down limbs here, and I don't want to land on one. Hey, look at this. I just thought of something right now. I can do some really great upper body training and get my cardio going more by doing some cartwheel kicks over the log. So I'm just gonna grab the log, kick my feet up and over. Oh, nice. Go back the other way, and All right, I can feel that. My whole core, my upper body, my arms, everything. Do that 10 or 20 times. Guaranteed to give you a bit of a workout. All right, this is Joseph Bronson, really asking you to get outside, work out, and enjoy the great outdoors. I'll see you at the Mountain Warrior Kung Fu Academy.